affected our strategy, but it definitely affected the game. Um, I was very pleased with our fitness level. I mean, to be fair, West Virginia is normally a team that they run you into the ground, and I actually thought today we ran them into the ground. Um, I thought both teams have to be commended for playing such a, a good, open-ended game in this heat. Um, you know, and it was a tough time. It was, it was a tough game. It was a, it was a really good game. And you know they found a way to, to score a goal, and you know we couldn't quite find a way to put one in. And we had you know lots of lots of moments. Mm -hmm. So you're playing against a uh, like a, a very good goalkeeper there. She had seven. Yeah, she was exceptional. I thought she was exceptional today. I told her after the game today. I thought she was the difference, not just in her shot stopping and her saving ability, but how she managed the game, balls at her feet, uh, taking crosses. I, I thought she. I thought we've probably seen the best goalkeeper in college soccer today. Yeah. Um, and also, can you talk a little bit about the. Uh, so Kellyanne played uh, and the contributions from freshman today? Yeah, I mean, listen, you know, <laughs> these kids all play at a good level in, in, in the club soccer world and they come to college to play in these games. And, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a tough baptism of fire to play for any of these kids against a team like West Virginia in the first game of the season. Um, but I thought she did really well. I thought Grace did really well. Um, I thought Jenna Menta was very lively for us and gave us a good spark coming off the bench as a freshman. Um, and I thought our, our older players did really, in particular, I thought Taylor Pack was outstanding today. Uh, I thought she was our best player. Um, and, and Caitlin Farrell, who's been carrying a bit of an injury, I thought she gave them fits. And, uh, and they didn't really have an answer for her. And I think if the game had gone on a little bit longer, I think we'd eventually got, we'd, she'd have got away from them. Yeah. And then, so what are you expecting Sunday against George Washington? Well, you know, George Washington, Georgetown, crosstown rival. Um, it's always going to be a tough game. In much the same way our kids would probably get fired up looking at this, we're playing West Virginia. Um, I'm sure the George Washington kids are looking at this, they're playing Georgetown local rival. Um, they're playing Georgetown final four caliber team. They're playing Georgetown number five in the nation. Um, so they're going, to be, they're going to be up for the game and I know they play tonight. Um, so it'll be another tough game. It's all, the last couple of years it's been a one goal game with them every time. All right, thanks a lot, Josh. Thanks.